In the fifth Dipper's Guide to the Unexplained Short, prompted by the discovery of a giant, seemingly human tooth, Dipper and Mabel first ask around town for any information pertaining to the tooth, and then eventually, following a lead, take a boat out onto the lake, where they discover a horrifying, floating, human-like head, which typically sits in the middle of the lake, pretending to be an island, and has an actual human mouth with human teeth in it that tries to eat them, and they barely escape it with their lives. The short ends with them discovering that it's lost another tooth, which is now also stuck on shore, and Mabel trying to make a dumb joke I'm assuming to defuse the situation because otherwise this short would just be too much for the kids watching it because holy crap this was horrifying. Like this was up there with the scariest stuff we have seen in this show ever and it just comes out of nowhere. It's shocking in how suddenly and completely it's there, how suddenly and completely it's realized. When do these take place? Like between seasons one and two or something? I'm kind of horrified now knowing that this thing was there in the lake for the entirety of the rest of the series and is still there within the universe of the show, at least. And apparently all the townspeople know about it and just cryptically warn people not to go anywhere near it in a way that's almost uncharacteristic for the people in this town who are used to weird shit, as if this thing is somehow worse than all of the stuff they deal with on a daily basis. I found the Mabel stuff in this one distracting, I didn't touch on it in the recap, but they keep injecting this joke of Mabel playing with this creepy old bear into tense scenes throughout the short, and I just find it really distracting, I don't think it works at all, really, but otherwise, this short is fantastic. This is exactly the kind of short that I was hoping we were going to get from these shorts since the very beginning. It's kind of become a criteria for me whether or not one of these shorts could be a main plot in an episode, and any short which passes that test automatically gets some extra points for me, and this one is definitely such a short. I want to see this thing fleshed out and explored desperately, and granted I haven't read the journal yet, the official release of the journal, so maybe there's something about it in there, I definitely hope that there is. But holy crap, I wish we'd gotten an episode about this thing. It's super creepy and super interesting, which you guys know at this point are two of my favorite things. Out of the five shorts that I've watched so far, if I was only allowed to recommend one of them, it would be this one. All of that said though guys, I'd like to know what did you think of this Gravity Falls short if you have seen it. Let's get discussion going in the comment section down below or over on my Discord. Link in the description. Either way though, this has been AJ22 and I will talk to you guys later.